Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You're tuned in with Dollface Shay. So today's look is going to be on the Box of Crayons eyeshadow palette. Um, I do use a few of her products, Supa's products, in this video. Um, I used her eyeshadow palette. I used the eraser sponges, and I also used her eyeliner. So it's not a complete um, Box of Crayons look. But let me just show you guys the palette. The Box of Crayons eyeshadow palette. I thought this was cute. Like eyeshadow, you get it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not wait to show you guys all these different looks I'm going to do with it because there's so many different colors in it. But today I did choose a simple look. And yeah, let's get right into the video. So you're wondering what is on my face. These are some eyeshadow guards that I'm going to use to do my eyeshadow today. I'm trying them out for the first time. I got these from Amazon. They were really cheap. I'll put down in the description the box below how much I paid for it. So you guys can use these as well. But yeah, let's get right into the video. This is the palette. Oh look, look at how many, it's like 18 colors in this palette go. And I believe I only paid like $30. Not only that, but this baby comes with a freaking mirror. Like, really? Really? And it's really nice. Like, I feel like it, when you travel, you can just bring this and you'll be good. Like, you don't have to worry about bringing an extra mirror. Well, I like to bring my hair, but anyway, but you know, just, you know, just for packing purposes. So I have no idea what colors I'm going to use. I'm just like thinking as I go. So I think I'm going to start off with tan. But yeah, just tune into y'all. This tan here as my um, transition color. I'm into the color brown. Literally just color called brown. I love this palette so far. And I'm gonna go right in above my crease. Not into the crease, but above my crease. Pigmented, I like it guys. I'm gonna keep blending, but I just wanted to show you the progress. I believe I'm gonna go with this deep plum right here. And go in right into my actual crease. I'm gonna cut my crease. I'm gonna be using my LA Pro Girl Concealer in Fawn. Oh, sorry, this is actually Warm Honey. I lied. I'm just gonna use a flat brush and start cutting it. I'm gonna go into my inner V corner with a little bit of black just to smoke it out. And I'm using this small brush here to go in with my inner V, and then I'm just smoke it out with a different brush. And I'm just gonna use the black. Use very little because this stuff gets a little bit harsh. I just wanna smoke it out just a little. I'm gonna take a blending brush and just blend out the harshness of it. A little bit of gold in my inner corners and just leave it because I kind of like this look that it's giving me. So I'm going to go and put the gold. We'll see how my mood is when I'm going to take my setting spray. Gold. This is so pretty. And then I'm going to go back in with my deep brown and smoke it out. Just to like make the colors mesh together. I'm going to take this color brown and just go, in with my, go over my deep brown with it. I literally just a pen like that. And I'm gonna go and do my eyeliner. So now that the eyeliner is done, I'm going to pop on my uh, mink lashes. So I reused them before, but they are in stone good condition. Gotta save you, gotta save your money, y'all. So I'm just gonna pop these on real quick. Now we're gonna get right into the foundation. Um, I'm gonna be using my Fit Me Ma Maybelline. It's a matte poreless, and it's in 360. It is in a darker shade than my normal look complexion. I normally use 355, but because I have a tan now, I'm gonna have to go a little bit darker than normal. So I'm just gonna get right into the foundation. I'm gonna use my Stiffly brush. Just a little bit. So 
so now that the foundation is done we're gonna go in with our concealer and i'm gonna be using the la pro girl concealer in one honey and i'm gonna go and highlight So I did purchase like this eraser sponge from the crayon case. It is super cute. It looks like an eraser. And I'm just gonna go with in with my NYX finishing matte spray and I'm going to blend out the concealer. So while that sets, we're gonna go in and put on some contour. And I'm gonna be using my favorite palette, the Black Radiance Contour Palette in Medium and Dark. And I'm just gonna use it in the contour color. Don't mind the palette, it looks a hot mess because I'm gonna use a flatter brush to do my contour of my nose. Now that all that is done, we're going to dust off the excess powder. So now I'm gonna go back in with my Box of Crayons palette and I'm gonna do a little bit of shadow underneath. So we can pull this look together, snatch it Go back in and put a little bit more gold into my inner corners. And I'm gonna spray it with my matte finish spray. So I'm gonna go back in with the same gold that I used earlier. Now I'm just gonna line my eyes with my pencil. It's very... <laughs> y'all i need another one i know i can't find my other one i just i don't have time so we're just gonna use a pencil day now that that is all finished before i put my highlight on i like to spray my makeup and i'm gonna do the matte finish spray that i used earlier I'm using my dirty secret highlighter that i got from this ipsy bag so i honestly don't know where i got it from but it is called soda pop and I'm gonna go in with my angled brush. I'm gonna highlight. Can you really have enough highlight though? Is that, is that a thing? <laughs> So now that my highlight is done, y'all, I'm gonna go in with this um, blush that I've gotten from the Shayla palette under construction, the color Construct. And I'm just gonna do a little bit on my cheeks. I'm not really a blush person, but. Now we're gonna move on to the lips. And I am going to be using, I wanna use like a nude color today since my eyes are a little bit dark. And this color is called Natural. It's ultra fine lip liner that I purchased off of Amazon. Um, I will link that down below as well. And I'm just gonna line my lips with it.
and I'm going to be using this ColourPop lipstick. I believe I got this from the first Makeup Shayla um, collection that she had, but honestly, I don't remember the color because it is no longer on the bottom. But it is a nude. Love nude. Honestly guys, I think I'm gonna go back in with my liner because I want the lips to really pop. I want an ex So yeah, I'm going back in with my eye, um, eye brush to refill my eyebrows because sometimes product get on it and I just like to go back in and fill them in just to make sure they're dark. So y'all, yeah, this completes the look. Let me know what you guys think about this look from Color Pop. Oh, oh so y'all, yeah, this completes the look. Please let me know what you think about this look. This is from the Box of Crayons palette look that I did for you guys. And I just wanna know what you guys think about it. So please, if you haven't already, like, subscribe, and comment down below. I wanna hear what y'all thoughts are about this look. And yeah, I'll see you guys soon in the next video. Love you, doll.